Hi, today I would like to show you how you can install this great looking about us template on your website using Dividend On Demand plugin. First thing you want to do is to go to settings and then click on Dividend On Demand page. And here you want to look for Dividend On Demand About Us page. It's the first one in the list here, but if you can't see it, uh, you want to type in, in the search box the name of the layout and it will pop up. Then you want to click the save button and at the very moment it is going to be saved to your library. Next thing you want to do is to go to pages, open the page where you want uh, this layout loaded, make sure that you have Divi uh, Builder enabled and here you want to click load layout. Now you want to select your save layouts and make sure to tick or to check dividend category. Then you are going to see dividend on demand about a layout. Simply click on it and in a moment it is going to be loaded onto the page. Other thing you want to do is to add the CSS for this page. So navigate back to files you downloaded and uh, here you want to open Dividend On Demand About Us CSS file. I use Notepad++ as my text editing software. Uh, it's a great enough free one and I recommend it. Uh, but you can open this file with any other text editing program. You want to copy uh, everything from here and paste it back on your uh, page. Here click Page Settings and paste the CSS inside Custom CSS box. Click Save and let's update and preview our page. Let's see if it looks good and awesome, there you go. Let me also show you how you can directly load the layout on your page. What we did earlier is we first saved the layout in our library and then loaded the layout from the library to the page. But let's see how we can directly load the layout on our page this time. So when you're on the edit page screen, you want to click low layout and here choose dividend on demand tab and from here you can simply click the load button below about us template. Click the load button and in a moment the layout is going to be loaded onto the page. There we go. Cool thing about this way of loading the layouts is that CSS is automatically added to custom CSS box so you don't have to copy and paste anything. All you have to do is to click the load button and the layout is ready. That Now you can click the update button and preview and enjoy your page. Let's see if it looks good, just, ma just making sure. And of course it does. Let me also now show you how you can customize this layout a bit. Uh, how you can update the images, texts, colors and more. For this we are going to enable Visual Builder. And with Visual Builder enabled, uh, to, it's very easy uh, to update elements. All you have to do is to click on them and to change the settings uh, while not leaving the page actually. Let me give you an example. If you would like to update this background image, simply hover over it. You can see that this blue uh, border appears so that you know that you have selected this section then click the settings icon and from here uh, you can edit uh, the element you have just clicked also you can see that I am uh, resizing this window so as while I'm editing this section uh, at the same time I can see how it is going to look like on my right and I want to toggle background here and simply click on the image to change it. Let's for example choose this one and as you can see the image has been immediately changed. Now I can click this uh, save button and uh, my changes have been saved. Let's for example change this text. Again I want to hover over it then go to settings and simply change the content. Our new text for example then to change how this text is going to look like, I want to go to design tab and here uh, you can change the, some general text uh, options, for example text color, text font, let's choose any, 
text letter spacing and of course more let me now show you how you can for example change these uh, lines color here uh, let's for example make everything green uh, simply hover over this element once again and then go to module settings uh, then go to design tab and change the color to something else let's choose green that's it now I could go uh, and do the same for each of these modules but let me also show you another trick what you can do is you can copy and paste the settings easily using Visual Builder so all you have to do is to click on this element uh, press Ctrl Alt and press C to copy and then Ctrl Alt and V to paste so you can see that uh, you can really quick and easy update elements on the page to update these icons here uh, go to settings and then toggle image and icon here you could update a new image for example or you can choose uh, to use an icon instead so you can see how that uh, looks like and perhaps that's it what else we could update here these numbers here but it's really the process is the same simply hover over it go to module settings uh, go to design tab and you can change uh, the number text for example and that's it so that's it for this tutorial I really hope you uh, like dividend on demand and our new free layout and thanks for watching